Hello and welcome back. In this video we discuss about acceleration field of a fluid in motion. We have seen earlier that velocity vectors of particles in the entire flow field can be represented as a velocity field. A velocity field can be mathematically represented as a function of space variables and time. Let u, v, and w are scalar functions that gives scalar components of a given velocity vector. Using this representation we can identify velocity vector of each particle in a flow field for a given x, y, z and time. In this video, we extend our discussion to acceleration field of a fluid in motion. Consider a velocity field. Time derivative of velocity field will provide acceleration field. Since velocity field is a function of space variables and time, the resulting differentiation results in partial derivatives of space and time variables, as indicated. The acceleration field vector has three components, a, x, a, y, and a, z. The operator d by dt is called material derivative or substantial derivative. Thank you for listening.